Usually, when we talk about the Indianapolis Motor Speedway, we're referring to the famed oval. Well, now plans are taking shape for a big circle near the track. The intersection in front of the speedway is going to be turned into a roundabout. It will connect 16th Street and Crawfordsville Road to Main Street and Speedway. Georgetown Road will be cut off from the intersection. RTV6 reporter Julie Persley gives us a closer look at the $14 million project that kicks into high gear next summer. The Speedway Redevelopment Commission says this intersection at 16th and Georgetown and Crawfordsville Roads is dangerous and failing. That's why it's turning this parking lot between 16th and Crawfordsville Road into a roundabout. The intersections at 16th and Main and Speedway and 16th at Georgetown and Crawfordsville Roads in front of the Indianapolis Motor Speedway will be going through a huge transformation by this time next year. Traffic lights will come down and the area will be turned into a roundabout with access points at 16th Street to the east, Crawfordsville Road to the west, and Main Street to the south. For 362 days a year, the roundabout will make this a much more functional, easy to use, uh, safer intersection. The three other days of the year are race days and police will be here directing traffic through the roundabout. I think this will work well for our law enforcement because it helps clean up what, what is a difficult intersection right now. So we're hoping that it actually will improve the flow for folks as they're coming to the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. Georgetown Road will be a dead end, which means people who use it to get downtown will need to find a new route. We've done uh, traffic modeling, a traffic impact analysis, and we know that if all the traffic along Georgetown Road is diverted to Tibbs and Lafayette, and Lynnhurst, the, those roads have the capacity to handle that traffic. Residents in Speedway say the change will take some getting used to. Better the signage to explain to people that need signage, <laughs> you know, the better off we'd be. But many welcome what they hope will be progress. We're pretty excited about this, especially during race time. We think it will really help. Most of the construction won't start until after the Indianapolis 500 wraps up next May. The roundabout is expected to be completed by November of 2014. From Speedway, Julie Persley, RTV6. And you might already notice a different change in Speedway. New street signs are gradually going up around the town. They are checkered to reflect the rich racing history in Speedway. Officials say the old signs are being replaced to meet new federal regulations requiring street signs to be larger and easy to read by the end of the year.